So how does it help to forget the past? Things like depression. Or help with anxiety, perceived future threats. So let's begin with forgetting about the past, like trauma, depression, that kind of stuff. You know, the kind of stuff that makes you go back in time and makes you feel like you're actually there with those same emotions generated when really you're probably just in an empty room and there's no issue around you whatsoever. That kind of stuff. So for a short time, these substances help you forget the past. And the only way they do that is with a release of dopamine. Okay, And that dopamine gives you a euphoric effect. Now, you can get that dopamine release with other stuff like hobbies or work or interests or anything that you're rewarding your brain with. But that stuff doesn't hit you instantly. Whereas with a, with a drink or with alcohol, that would hit you straight directly and dopamine will be released in your brain and your brain will have this reward. It only give you an effect of happiness and excitement. Now, what's happening here is with your past, you're not dealing with it because you're generating happiness and excitement currently, but with what, whatever happened in your past, you're not resolving that. But for the time being, it's making you feel better. So what you're gonna try and keep doing is you're gonna try and keep taking this drug or alcohol substance to make you feel better consistently. But then what happens is when that effect runs out, that makes you crash, obviously. And that's what used to happen to me. And when it makes you crash, it comes back worse. So you're in this cycle of addiction. You're taking more and more for the excitement and the happiness. And the opposite to that, with happiness is sadness and with excitement is boredom. So we all know as an addict, boredom is one of our problems. Why? Because we are so used to taking excitement most of the time. And um, happiness, well, sadness is a problem as well. And because again, we are so used to taking the drugs and trying to build our own happiness, which isn't real uh, within us, uh, through a chemical, uh, then that which will then release a chemical of dopamine into our brain. That then doesn't last for long. And we just consistently then chasing this effect, which is the euphor euphoric effect through psychoactive substances like alcohol, cocaine, and cannabis.